Hi, welcome back to our channel. This week we are going to do a quick little video for you to introduce two new mares that we've been riding recently. Excitingly, our instructor had two horses that were coming back from maternity leave at the same time so she needed two bums for two horses and we were ready made <laughs> so she and her daughter aren't currently able to ride them themselves so we don't know how long we're gonna be riding them for but we're currently just helping them get them back to being a little bit more fit and uh, getting rid of those baby bellies yeah so we're going to just talk you over a few clips just now, just get right into it, to introduce them to you so that when they feature going forward in the channel, you know who they are and what they're all about. Roll camera. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Roll BD. So these two mares are both very green and have been backed but not very much else. We'll start with Millie. She is a 16-3 bay mare who is rising 10. She was broken in when she was four and then had an unfortunate injury and was turned away. When she came back to try and come back into work, they felt she was still not quite right. So she was put into fold to have a baby instead. The other mare is Tilly. and She's a 15-3 dark bay mare um, and she's rising eight. Um, she has actually had two babies, so she was back at four, um, ridden for a little bit and then has come out of work to have a baby. Then when she was due to be coming back into work, um, they didn't have the time to be bringing her back into work, so decided that she would have a baby number two. So she has two babies, um, and so she's actually spent more of her life uh, not ridden than ridden. Um, so she's a quite green as well. Um, so I ride Tilly, that's Heather for riding Tilly, and Ailey rides Millie. Um, yep. Height difference is I'm yep. five foot two and Ailey's five foot six. I was gonna say, so. no, other, no other reason other than the height, to yeah. be honest. <laughs> so for predominantly, they're just very, very unfit, and as you can see, very, very fat. So most of the work we've been doing is walking, just walking with a little bit of trot at the end of each session, which they do struggle with actually. Um, if anyone, anyone's ever brought horses back into work, you know that taking it slow and steady is the way to go. Um, so that's really all we've got of them at the moment, although we're hoping to continue to work on things and taking it up a gear as they are able to. Yeah, it's really exciting for us. It's a really great opportunity to learn um, with us both wanting to buy our own horses later on in the near future. Um, it gives us an idea of what sort of capabilities we have um, and what sort of horses we can be looking for as well given that for most of our lives we've been on the same sort of horses. Um, we're both really loving riding more regularly uh, particularly with Covid and um, stopping us from riding on normal ones at the moment. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, they're, they're really, really good opportunity for us both and we're yeah. really excited. So yes, thank you to our instructor Lisa for thinking of us and giving us this chance and hopefully we do you proud <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Yeah, we've had a few sticky moments uh, just baby green moments shall we say um but so far so good so far touch wood oh God, yeah we're going today <laughs> so far we're doing okay <laughs> thank you for watching this video just thought a quick introduction to the girls would be a nice little video so that you're not confused when they feature further into the channel. Please comment, like and subscribe and follow us on all of our other social medias. We'll leave them linked below and all of our updates are generally the most up to date on Instagram. Yes. At two jolly duckies everywhere. Shameless plug. Mm -hmm. Right, signing out. Peace out. Bye. Bye. <laughs>